what's up guys it is boss to hit it crash with nate and today we are starting a new video series of uh, two videos maybe more so far it's two of slingshots for the first video that i'm doing which we today i am reviewing my daisy carline slingshot we're gonna slingshot if you've watched my slow-mo confrontation what a confirmation check it out the slingshots in it and then, then I'm shooting rocks. But I'll be doing a review of this. Let's get right into it. So, like I said, for this first video, um, you'll be reviewing the Daisy Powerline Slingshot. If you've watched my slow mo compilation, my slow motion compilation, this slingshot was in it. Because it's really cool to watch in slow motion. Um, the things I liked about the slingshot are that it's ambidextrous. These grips aren't are good, but they're not geared for one hand. Which you can use it for a left, which I'm a righty, I can also shoot left. I prefer it is right, but I can shoot left too. Pretty good too. And when if my sister picked this up, because she's a lefty, she can shoot it. And also, another thing I like about this slingshot is that wherever you whatever in between here is what you're gonna hit. Whatever right in here, right about there, in the middle, is where you're gonna hit. About right here, and right there in the middle is where you're gonna hit. Which means it's deadly accurate, especially with BBs. And with steel BBs, I recommend steel or just rocks, because the glass, no one wants to step on glass in the backyard. Glass is cheaper though, but if you're gonna go hunting with these, like for small game, you can probably take kind of pheasant with this. Or even a, a squirrels, rabbits, pheasants, even. It still BBs are nice because it'll, they're really powerful and accurate. And you also have to take a chance of them cracking in the pouch. You can also reuse them. So if I'm planting in the backyard, I have built a BB trap where I can use them and this can use the BBs because it catches the BBs. So I'm going to be showing you that, and there's a, I'll be showing that in the next video. But, for now, let's get into some shooting. So yeah. And the RMP is also really nice, because it allows you to get more power and stability in your shot. 